Hey little beans, we are trying to reach 200,000 subscribers. To help us get there, don't forget to subscribe and turn on personal notifications so you never miss any of my uploads. If you have spent a lot of time inside the new Valentine's Day Divinia pack, you may or may not have noticed that there are lots of little secrets for you guys to discover inside of the realm. Today you guys, I'm going to share with you three secrets that I think you may not have noticed, and one of them in particular, what it could be showcasing for the future of the game. Hey little beans, my name is B and welcome back to another video. Before we get started, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell so you never miss any of my daily Royal High videos. And of course, don't forget to use star code B when buying Robux or Premium. You guys, today I am super excited because we are going to check out some very exciting secrets inside of Divinia Park. That's right you guys, there's a lot of little secrets inside of the realm that you may not have noticed. But we've picked three of our favourite ones to show you today starting with the smallest to the largest with the last one having maybe some exciting indications for future updates that's right you guys but before we get started i just want to say a massive thank you to all of our channel members who support us every single month you guys are absolutely incredibly awesome and we appreciate you more than you'll ever know so thank you so much all right little beans let's get started now right now where i'm stood is on davinia dock so if you guys want to go over to the dock this is one of the easiest places to find our first little secret which is the smallest secret that we have in game you guys this one's not as big of a deal as some others but if you come over here you may not have noticed that all of the devs that worked on the valentine's divinia pack are actually listed right here on the wall so we have kalin charlie ready the teddy vionchi and jam jam listed on the wall with their initials drawn with what looks like a marker pen into the tree so you guys can obviously see those right over here next to the dock and it is a little secret it's not a huge secret you guys it's not a huge huge thing but it is a secret nonetheless and for those of you who discovered it let me know in the comments down below i just really wanted to share that with you because i just thought it was super cute all right, you guys, so the next secret requires us to use our teleport function. We're going to go ahead and click on teleport, and we are going to go over to the stage show. So if you guys wait for the next stager to come on inside the game, you may actually notice that there's something very special inside of it. If you look closely when the stage show starts, you may see yourself inside of the stage show. Sometimes it uses your models from when you're online inside of it. But if you look extra closely, you may also realise that I am featured inside of it. That's right, little beans. I am actually inside of the stage show for all of you to see see as you can see I'm right here and I'm sat there playing an instrument along with everybody else I was in it last year as well and one thing you might not know is that you actually will see me regardless of whether I'm online or not so even if I'm not in your server you will still see me inside of the stage show with you guys so you can come and have a little dance with me or take some screens with me if you want to but that is my Roblox avatar in case you didn't already know so you guys can actually see me inside of the game Game. How cool is that little beans? I was so flattered when they included me in it and it made me feel so good So I'm really really happy about that Next up, you're going to need to teleport back to the Dock of Davinia. This is for the larger one, you guys, that I think is going to be a big deal in the game. Go into your fly mode and you're going to fly straight out to this big tree over here. And as you may already know, but you may not know, there is a secret little hovel inside of the tree. If you go inside, you will be greeted with a witch cave, you guys, which you can come inside of, stand in front of the cauldron, get some really nice witchy screenshots. You can wear some of your witch hats and things like that if you want to and you can take some beautiful pictures in here but it does make you wonder why is there specifically a witch hut inside of royal highs divinia park on valentine's day and why does it look like maybe they're brewing some love potions well you guys i don't know if there's actually going to be something specific about this witch hut i don't know if there's going to be a specific reason why it's been implemented into the game but whatever it might be i personally feel very excited about it i think this looks super super cute you guys and i think more magical things in the game definitely wouldn't 
doesn't go amiss. I think everyone in the community would really love to see more magical things like this witch curve and things like that, that you can actually come into and maybe even interact with. Right now you can just take pictures in here, there's nothing to actually click on, but it would be cool if you could actually interact with it and brew spells or maybe stand over it with a giant wooden spoon staring it or something like that, you guys. I just think that would look so cool. This is super cute, you guys, and honestly, I am so impressed with how gorgeous this looks. You may remember I actually took some videos. I did one on TikTok. If you haven't followed me on TikTok, it's B Plays Roblox. The link is down below. I also posted a YouTube video about it, and my fair screenshots that I posted on Twitter are in here as well. But this is just such a cute little secret, and I'm really glad the devs decided to include this. I don't think this was in last year's Valentine's update. I'm fairly sure this year is the first time this was added, and it just looks so cute. I don't know if it was Vionchi or someone else who decided to put it here, but I just really love it, you guys, and every time I come here, I just want to do witchy stuff and take screenshots and make pretty pictures and stuff like that, and I don't know, I just really love it. I am, I am calling, calling on the, on the witch, witch spirit, spirit to cast, cast a spell, spell to get all the people, people who are watching, watching this video to subscribe to Bplays Roblox on YouTube, on YouTube so, so we can we reach 200,000 subscribers. Anyways, okay, so the next thing we're going to go and look at, you guys, is an honourable mention, since obviously that one is the biggest one. This is an honourable mention because it's not really a secret but it is super cool. If you guys head on over to just past the big tree with the letters on, you'll find a cute little lily pad style area, all colorful like coral, just behind the Lunar New Year area, you guys. It's a bit of a walk over, but if you come over and find it, you can. And it's all glowy and pretty and gorgeous with the same type of glowing that we had on the items that were the seashells inside of New Year's. And I just look at this, you guys, and it's just so pretty. And I just had to show is in the video as an honorable mention because even though it's not a secret it is such a gorgeous thing that they decided to feature in the game and i just think this just looks so beautiful and i am so glad they decided to include it it's actually become one of my favorite places to record and if you guys haven't noticed the pink grass actually turns golden in this area as well if you walk away then the lanterns disappear but when you come close you'll see the lunar new year area actually loads in that's to save from lag issues you guys it hides the lunar new year area but if you come inside, you will see it come up and look, all the grass turns golden in this area instead of pink. And it just looks absolutely incredible. I am blown away by how beautiful this looks and just in general, find this to be so gorgeous, you guys. I just love it so much. And again, if you haven't noticed already, there is obviously pink grass inside the Valentine side of things. So Lunar New Year has gold and then Valentine's has pink. And this is just so beautiful you guys now one last honorable mention is that if you didn't know ophelia who was here in the previous update is back so you can come over and get a paper lantern apparently some people still don't know how to get the paper lanterns we've shown it in videos a lot but i still get a lot of comments on people asking me how they get them so if you need help you guys you just go over and talk to her she'll give you the lantern you click on it then you type in who you want to obviously be featured and then launch it up into the air you guys and then it launches up with your name floating above it as you can see i think it lasts two and a half minutes i think Callan said before it expires but on the board over here if you come and look it will actually say your name plus the person who you connected it to so i put in the little beans but yeah you guys it's just super cute a little cute thing up there that i just love and as you can see it just floats away up there all pretty and gorgeous and just looking all precious up in the sky i just think it looks super cute so yeah it's a nice little honorable mention as well all right, you guys, so there's a few of these secrets that are inside of the new Divinia pack for Valentine's Day, particularly useful for newer players who might not know where they are. And of course, I hope you enjoyed this video or found it useful in some way. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, and click that bell. And let me know in the comments what you think the witch curve could be indicating. Do you think we're going to get more witchy things in the future? I certainly hope so. Thanks so much for watching, little beans. I'll see you all next time. You stack up B when getting Robux or premium and i'll see you all soon love you all lots of little beans have a great day goodbye